ビビだイエーイ Hello, friends, and welcome back to the BB Dot Show. How are you guys doing today? Great. I'm doing fantastic. And I'm so excited to be here with you guys today. Guess what letter we're going to be learning about? Good. A lot of you remembered. We're going to be learning about the letter Y. Remember, we made Y's last time with our body? Can you do that again? Good, I see you guys out there doing it, some of you. Do you know what a capital Y looks like? Some of you do. I'm going to show you what one looks like. This, my friends, is a capital Y. Can you say Y? Good job. Say Y. Good job, friends. Can you say capital Y? Great, yes. This is a capital Y. See how it's pretty big. That's how come we know it's a capital Y. It's the big Y. Now, what do you think a lowercase Y looks like? Good, I hear a lot of you saying, just like a little capital Y. Well, you're right. This, my friends, is what a lowercase Y looks like. Let's put it over here where it goes. Isn't that cute? This is a lowercase y, and this is a capital Y. Say lowercase y. Good job. Lowercase y. Good job. Say y one more time, y. Good job, friends. We are gonna put our special orange Y's down now and we're gonna play our fun guessing game. Are you guys ready? Good, me too. Let's put them down right there so they don't get messed up. Okay, for those of you that don't know how to play our guessing game, I'm gonna teach you. So I'm gonna be thinking of a word that starts with the letter Y. I'm gonna give you friends at home some clues to try and guess the word I'm thinking of. Are you ready? Great, here we go. Here's your first clue to the first word that starts with the letter Y. Okay, it's a color. Mm, it's bright. Mm -hmm. BB Dot's wearing this color. I hear a lot of you guys guessing already. It's the color of the sun. <gasps> it starts with a Y. It's gonna make a yeah, yeah, yeah sound in the beginning. <gasps> it looks like the bees up there even have the color on. <gasps> and guess what? This really cool ball has the color in it. <gasps> Do you see it in there? What color am I thinking of? It starts with a Y. That's right, you guys are so smart. It's the color yellow. You guys, I can't trick you. You're so smart. The color yellow. The sun is yellow. BB Dot's wearing yellow. Our bees are yellow and so is the little dot. And this big ball has yellow in it. And orange and all different shades of yellow and orange. Isn't it pretty? Can you say yellow? Good job, friends, say yellow. Good, one more time for me, say yellow. Great, you guys are so smart. You amaze me every day. Are you guys ready for your next clue to the second word that starts with a Y? Me too, okay. This, my friends, is an animal. Thinking of an animal, and it starts with the letter Y. So think, hmm, it's gonna begin with the sound that starts with ya, ya, ya. Are you ready? It has horns, and it has lots of hair hanging on it. 
and it lives high up in the mountains. That's where it thrives, high up in the mountains, like in the Tibetan mountains. Hmm, they're very friendly, especially with humans. Hmm, what else can I tell you about it? They're closely related to a buffalo or a bison. Do you know what I'm thinking of? Remember, it's an animal, and it starts with the letter Y. Yeah, yeah. It's a funny word, too. Has anyone guessed it yet? I heard one of you guys guess it. You're right. It's the yak. Isn't that a funny word? Try saying it. Say yak. Good job. This, friends, is what a yak looks like. <gasps> Look at this yak. Whoa, say yak. Good job, friends. Isn't he cute? Look at him. And he's friendly with humans. He gets along great with humans. The only time that they might get a little aggressive with humans is if it's a female and she has a baby and you're trying to play with her baby, she might get a little mad because she likes to protect her babies. We all like to protect our babies, don't we? Yes. So this is a yak. Can you say yak? Good, say yak. Good job, friends. Say yak one more time. Good job. Well, Mr. Yak, we're gonna put you down. Thank you so much for showing my friends what you look like. He's so cute. I wish I had a yak as a pet. That would be fun. Okay, are you guys ready for our third word? That BB Dot's thinking about, that starts with the letter Y. You ready for the first clue? Here we go. Hmm, it's a toy. Hmm, you might have seen them at the stores or maybe you have one at home. Hmm, it has a string connected to it with two round cylinder parts that the string wraps around on the middle. Hmm, and then you roll the string around and then you put your finger through the string, the little part that the string holds onto your finger and you wind it up and then you go and you drop it and then it's supposed to come back and you catch it. <gasps> Do you know what I'm talking about? I hear a lot of you guys saying it. A lot of you guys know what I'm talking about. You must have one at home. <gasps> hmm, they come in all sorts of colors and some of them come in different shapes. They're not all a circle. Hmm, it starts with a Y, a Y, Y. That's gonna be the sound it starts with. Can you think of it? Good job, friends. Yes, it's a yo-yo. A yo-yo. Yo-yos are so much fun. Look at this yo-yo I found. <gasps> Whoa. This is a ball yo-yo. Have you ever seen one of these? Me neither. I just found it at the store the other day. I was like, <gasps> a ball yo-yo? This one comes back to you every time. <gasps> you wanna watch BB Dot try it? Great, I'm gonna open it and try it and see if it works. Hmm, let's open this up. <gasps> Ooh, fun, I like to open stuff. Wow, there's so much packaging. Ooh, I gotta go through a lot of stuff just to get to this little yo-yo. Oh, okay, <gasps> this is gonna be fun. Are you guys ready? This is a ball yo-yo. Hmm, do you see the little part I said you put your finger through? Okay, we're gonna try it out. Are you guys ready? <gasps> I'm excited. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna step back so you can see the whole thing. Here we go. That didn't go very far. Went a little further. Whoa, maybe I gotta stretch it out a little, huh? Look at it, comes right back up to me, and I can catch it. Yo-yo. This is a yo-yo ball. <gasps> Wasn't this fun? Whoa, that one almost touched the ground. <gasps> wow, 
do you see it spinning while it's going down? Let's put it on my finger a little better. Let's see. Ready, set, here we go. Woo, that was fun. I could do this all day. Wow, fun. Yo-yo ball. Everyone say yo-yo. Good job, say yo-yo. Great job, guys. Say yo-yo one more time, yo-yo. Good job, yes. And this is a yo-yo ball. And it's one of my favorite toys now. I think I'm gonna play with it every day. Yep. Let's take up our yo-yo ball now because do you know what time it is, friends? That's right, it's time to ring Fairy Fran's bell. And she's gonna tell us some fun facts about what we've learned today. That starts with the letter Y. Are you guys ready? Here we go, we're gonna ring her bell. <gasps> Fairy Fran, are you awake? Are you in your house? Oh, hi, you are awake. Oh, you've been waiting for us. I didn't know, I'm sorry, did I take too long? Okay, good. Well, Fairy Fran, you sure do look pretty today. You're welcome. Where would you like to sit today? In the window, in the house, over there. Okay. Let's see if you can fit. Let's see, Fairy Fran, if I can just put you in the house and you can sit right here on the window. Okay, there you go. All right, Fairy Fran, I hope you feel safe up there. Don't fall, it's a far drop. Fairy friend, what do you have to tell us today that we have learned about the letter Y? <gasps> You're kidding. <gasps> well, that's pretty neat. Can I share all that information with my friends? Thank you. Well, guys. She taught me a lot of cool stuff about the yo-yo that I didn't know. You guys ready? Listen to this. Did you know that the first modern yo-yo was called the Whirly Gig? Isn't that silly? The Whirly Gig. Let's play with the Whirly Gig. Doesn't that sound silly? I like yo-yo better. Or they also called it the Bandalore. Well, that's a funny name too, isn't it? I sure do like the yo-yo a lot better than those names. Yo-yo is a lot easier to say too, don't you think? Yeah, I agree. Did you also know that there's competitions all over the world? People come from all over the world and they compete with each other with these yo-yos. They know how to do tricks and all kinds of neat stuff with yo-yos. They spend all day practicing and then they go to far off places, far off countries, and they compete to win things, win prizes like trophies and stuff. Isn't that cool? Japan has some of the best yo-yo masters around. I didn't know that. That's pretty neat. It takes a long time to be a yo-yo master. You have to practice and practice and practice and practice and practice and practice and practice. Did you also know that the most common trick that you can do with the yo-yo is called walk the dog and it looks like the yo-yo is spinning on the ground by your feet. So you can make it drop down and it spins by your feet and it looks like you're walking the dog. A lot of people know how to do that. It's the most common trick you can do with the yo-yo. Isn't that neat? That's pretty neat. Thank you so much, Fairy Fran, for all of your interesting information about the yo-yo. We appreciate it. You are smart and you're making all of us out there a lot smarter. Thank you very much. Guys, do you know what time it is? That's right. It's time for BB Dot to put on her big bodacious green googly eyed glasses and see who's out there watching today. <gasps> my favorite part, I get to see all my friends. Here we go, are you guys ready? Oh, you're just gonna roll away. Okay, here we go. Get ready for this because I think I'm going to see some 
friends I haven't seen in a long time. Let's see who we're gonna see. Oh wow, there's Rachel and Kaya and Jake. Hi you guys, it's so good to see you. There's Harris and Cindy and Catherine and Michael. Hi guys, how are you doing? I miss you guys. There's PT and Laura and Hayden. Oh, there's Logan. How are you guys doing? Thanks for watching. Oh boy, there's Corky and Georgie. Hi guys, it's so good to see you guys. Thank you so much for stopping by today and watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. Do you know what we're gonna learn next time? That's right, we're gonna learn the letter Z. <gasps> wow, it's gonna be so much fun. And the Z has a really cool song that goes with it. Before we leave, what do we need to remember? That's right, you guys remembered. Always be kind to everyone. Your family and your friends and your neighbors and strangers. Just everybody. Just be kind to everyone. Thanks for joining, guys. See you next time. Bye.